Welcome back to the Big Jimmy Cigar Review. You can call me DJ, and today we're taking a look at some budget cigars. I want to talk to you all about some budget cigars, and I want to get your opinion on budget cigars. See, because here's my thing. In life, there's a great adage that you get what you pay for. And while I 100% agree with that, it doesn't mean that there can't be a great gem of a discount. Because I've reviewed several budget cigars on this channel, and I'll link them down below, ones that I think you should check out. Don't sleep on budget cigars, because here's the thing. Oftentimes, you can get fantastic fantastic values for very, very cheap. So don't sleep on a $2 cigar. Here's a list of a couple great options for you. First and foremost to me, the king of budget cigars is the Quorum Shade. This is a fantastic low budget option by J.C. Newman. It's a Connecticut Shade Cigar. In my opinion, it is by far the best Connecticut Shade Cigar on the market for under $2. It's hard to beat. It's fantastic quality. It's very natural, sweet, tobacco, light, very good smoke overall. Definitely worth checking. Another option that might be a great budget cigar is this one right here. It's the Casa de Garcia. I was actually asked to review this cigar, and I will be doing a review on this cigar. I may actually smoke it today. Um, however, I don't know a lot of information about it yet. Here's what I will say about this cigar. It has the same natural tobacco sweetness smell of the Quorum Shade Cigar, which I love so much. So I'm excited to try this one. I can't put it on the list, but this might be an option. And if you've had the Casa de Garcia, let me know. It's about a $2 smoke. This is a larger size, so I think it was $2.80, but you can get them pretty cheap. Another fantastic budget cigar, of course, is the Drew Estate line. Again, I've smoked several of them. We got the Maduro here today. It's a fantastic, rich smoke for around $2. Drew Estate Factory Smokes has several options. They have a Shade, a Maduro, a Sweet Habano, and I believe they also have a Candela. I have not smoked the Candela. I keep looking for it. No one around me has it, but I have smoked the other three, and I really like the Maduro and the Connecticut Shade. The Connecticut Shade is almost like a cheap knockoff of the Undercrown Shade. It's a little spicier than the Undercrown Shade, but has very similar notes, and you can get it for around $2. Today, as soon as I'm done smoke doing this, video, I'm actually going to smoke the Habano Sweets. This was another request from a reviewer. I had this cigar two times already. Both times I didn't love it, but I wanted to give it one more chance, third time's a charm, right, and shoot a review for it. I'm shooting that right after I'm done doing this video. Another fantastic option that I absolutely love and I think is underrated is the Schizo by Asylum. If you had not have a Schizo by Asylum, again, fantastic smoke. It's a nice, light, flavorful cigar that comes in natural and Maduro. Both are great options. Both you can get around for about $2 a cigar. You can even get a Mondo size. You can also get a nice Gordo size of the Schizo, which I smoked for only $4. Great value, great cigar, lasts a long time, fantastic flavors. The other point of this video was to act as a way to share budget friendly cigars with others. What are some great smokes y'all smoked? Let me know in the comments down below. Make a list. If there's not, if there's something I've missed, if there's something I need to review, let me know. Maybe you've smoked a gem that you think is underrated. I got one. I have one. Oh, I actually thought of another cigar. Uh, let me throw a picture of it on screen. It's this the cigar that tried as a knockoff Cohiba's branding. I found him for around $1.50 in a cigar shop now me near me and I figured hell it's a dollar fifty if it's crap no big deal it was fantastic and the burn on it was actually fucking legendary for a two dollar cigar I mean look at this photo it speaks for itself it's a great quality great taste so what are some fantastic budget options that you would recommend let me know in the comment down below so don't knock something until you try it because you never know what type of a fantastic find you might find just because something cheap doesn't mean it is bad. Just because something is expensive doesn't mean it's great. Link to that video here. Boys, you can call me DJ. Thanks for watching PJ, and I'll see y'all in the next one.